back to Valley View Live. Now, the script says that we're pleased to have vocalist Andrew <laughs> Ragone of Steve Wynn's Showstoppers here with us today, but he's also a dancer and a comedian, and there's probably <laughs> something else that's going to come a out show during host. this interview. Exactly. He's a great show host. You saw him working it with Dow for uh, the yeah. deal. So. I really did so. order the Arm & Hammer toothpaste, by the way. All right. Oh. I really did. Oh. So. Send it to my dressing room. <laughs> 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 okay, so now She'll how did you get started somewhere. in show business? How did I get started? Um, I grew up in um, in Northern California, All right. and uh, I did like children's theater kind of growing up, and um, my found this voice teacher that was in Phantom of the Opera in San Francisco. No way. And um, so I studied with him uh, for probably eight to ten years. How old were you then? Yeah. So even I was like in knew? middle school when it started, and um, I loved the show. You I need to up. appreciate Phantom. Oh my God, I loved it. I went and saw the show probably ten times. Oh. I mean, he would always wow. get me tickets, and I would. I just dreamed of being oh. in a, in a show. My big thing was I wanted to be in a show where I could move people and make people have a great time. And I never wanted you with Christine anyway. Ah, uh, you did. <laughs> Yeah. You want it for yourself? I, 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 like I said, she'll, she'll deliver do that yeah. 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 to You don't do hair, so she said, forget it. Oh, okay, okay. <laughs> yeah. But anyways, um, and then uh, I went to move to New York, and um, I did a couple other Broadway shows, but then came Phantom here in, in Las Vegas. Okay, when you found out you were going to do Phantom in Vegas, did you just feel like the heavens just opened? I, I really did, because when you do something in your life that, you know, as you come full circle back yes, to something that you yes. dreamed of as a kid, yeah, yeah. it meant so much to okay. do it. And, um, and the director, Hal Prince, who's the most legendary theatrical director in, in history, he, you know, working, getting cast twice from him. What, the other show was Evita, the Broadway show Evita, <laughs> nice. and then this one. And um, wow. so just being a part of something so beautiful. And you, yeah. you probably all saw it at the Venetian. It was oh, yeah. beautiful. I believe the chandelier is still there. Is yeah. it? Yeah. They I haven't been back. Down. I don't know <laughs> if I could walk back in there <laughs> and see it. I'm like, oh, it would just oh, be strange. Yeah. 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 How different is the job. version here in Vegas, maybe different from other phantoms? Uh, the, the version here was pretty close. It had a lot of added elements when it was here, and it had just more, it had to be more Vegas. That's why okay. it was so successful here, because I think it made it a special Vegas moment. Yeah. So, um, but it's great being back in this show, because we get to do songs like that, but then a lot of other different materials, so you're never kind of just doing one role. You get to, like you said, you get yeah. to dance, you have to sing, you have to, you know, exactly talk Exactly what jokes. you yeah. wanted to do as a kid. Yeah, yeah. exactly. And that's the stuff that when you do a show called Showstoppers, I mean, there's a lot of pressure internally, I feel, each night I have to go out there and make sure this audience is entertained. And we just hope at the show, all of us, there's six of us um, principal vocalists and 29 dancers, I mean, 31 piece orchestra, which on Broadway, they're lucky to have like 15. So if anyone's yeah. never seen a 31 piece orchestra or heard that, it, you sit in our audience and it's like starts okay. from the top, it just blows you away. Okay. And I think what our big thing is just leave the audience with joy and entertainment and and they walk out. I mean, we get. We've been so lucky. We had standing yeah. ovations every night. Yeah. I mean, oh, I mean, wow. for a new show to be a brand new show on the strip, we we're over the moon. And the reviewers have been so kind to us. And I think you know, we just hope all the you know our Vegas locals come out and see the show. And and I think you'll. We guarantee we'll you'll have a great time. They will well, here's now. the information, folks. Catch Andrew Ragon. Steve wins showstoppers at Win Las Vegas for tickets and showtimes. Call the number or check out the website on your screen.